If you want to know how to take this egg and turn it into a classic French omelette, then stay tuned and we'll show you exactly how to do it. What I'm going to show you today is how to make a classic French farm omelet in a carbon steel pan. This pan, by the way, is a Mat 4 Bourguet French classic 8.5 inch carbon steel pan. It's very heavy, it's well seasoned as you can see, and I use this every day for my eggs. So what I've done is I'm going to turn my heat up to about 2 and I won't touch it. I'll just leave it at 2. And today we're going to use butter for our uh, cooking medium per se. I'll just put it on the side here, kind of move it around. We'll let that melt and let it uh, almost bubble. The uh, French omelette is a omelet that looks like a cigar. It's folded over on itself but the top of the omelet is slightly browned coming from basically from overheating it or from uh, the butter being a little bit warmer or hotter let's say so I'm going to show you exactly how that's done what I've done is I took an egg out already I usually use organic eggs you don't use any kind of egg you want to and I let it at uh, room temperature for maybe 15 minutes if it's too cold right out of the refrigerator what's going to happen is now you have a differential in heat between the, the egg and the surface of the pan and basically I would like to have the egg at least at room temperature so a little easier to work with you can actually do both ways if you want to and you have to kind of experiment to see which is best for you All right, the butter is starting to melt a little bit now Gonna let it get a little bit warmer before before we put the egg in. All right, let's put the egg in now. If I don't spill it all over, and as soon as it goes in, what it starts doing is starts moving the the pan back and forth. And this is a nice heavy pan, so it doesn't flop wildly around the top of your burner and when I mix it with my egg right now what I'm doing or with my fork rather I'm just using the back side of the tongs tongs tang tines <laughs> just on the surface I don't get, scrub it right down to the bottom of the pan just gently moving it we're gonna let that uh, just keep shaking it because I want it loose on the bottom of the pan you can see it's moving around nicely because it's, this pan is non-stick at this point. We're just going to keep doing it a little bit more. I want it, I want it to be a little bit brown on the bottom, so I'm going to leave it longer in the, on the base of the pan itself. Then we'll start turning it. Let me tip it up a little bit, see how it's doing. A little white yet. The classic French farm omelet is as brown on the top, whereas the classic French omelet is this color all the way across the top of the egg. All right, so I'm going to take this over now. I'm going to fold it over, fold it over again, fold it over again. Bang. Okay. It's not as brown as I'd like it to be. It would be browner if I left it on longer. But there are some areas in here that are slightly brown. Now we'll take, turn the heat off. And I'm going to turn it like this and then just flip it over. Boom, so the seam is on the bottom. Now what we can do is we can shape it if we want to. So it looks like a little like a cigar. And I know there's a lot of butter on it already, but since I'm one seventh French in my heritage. I'm going to put a little butter on the top like this here. Leave that there. I'm going to put some Himalayan salt on it. Some fresh ground pepper. And now what I'm going to do is normally I don't do this but just for you I'm going to 
I'm going to cut it in half. And the reason I'm doing that is I want to show you that the inside of the egg, right in here, should be creamy or custard-like. And it'll give it a, when, if you can make your eggs like this, it's going to be a whole new experience in eating eggs in the morning. So there we have it. It's the classic French farm omelet. And thanks for watching. If you have any questions, put them down below. And I'm going to have a few more videos on using the mat for Bourget, Bourget uh, carbon steel pan. Uh, before I go, what I might do is show you how I clean this pan. I usually use a paper towel. Just pick it up, wipe it down like this. This one I'm going to uh, put in here. Take a second paper towel and just kind of wipe it out. I don't need to put water, don't need to put it in the sink. And the oil and the butter that's left in it will uh, keep it from rusting and it just keeps it in great shape. So there you have it, the Maffer Bourget pan showing you how to make a classic French farm omelet. With, with this is one egg, you can use two or three if you want to. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this and learned something. Thanks for watching.